tonight, we are seeing new video that captures a deadly hit and run that killed a man over the weekend. That crash happened at about three Sunday morning in Grand Rapids. We do want to warn you that the video in this story may be disturbing. News 8's Amanda Porter has our first look at the surveillance video and a car that police are still looking for the driver. Amanda. It was here on Division Avenue South in Andre Street where a man was walking into this crosswalk where video shows he was hit by a car that just kept going. A man walking into the right side of the frame is moments away from being killed in a hit and run crash. He walks into the crosswalk area marked with white lines as cars drive by. After a red car passes, the man steps onto the crosswalk, continuing to cross the street, walking slightly north of the white lines, when it looks as though he hears a car and turns around, possibly realizing he was about to be hit by a car. His arms go out wide, seemingly caught in a position no one wants to be in, staring down headlights on a busy street. It looks as though he tries to run back across the street when from the right, a car with red brake lights on hits the man. The car keeps going with the brake lights releasing as the man is lying in the middle of Division Avenue. A car passes by him, braking slowly before another car stops to block traffic around the pedestrian. I spoke with witnesses in the area who told me officers performed CPR, but the man died at the scene. Michigan drivers are required by law to yield the right of way in all instances to avoid a crash. In 2022, there were 173 deadly pedestrian crashes in Michigan. Motorists should always be looking out for people at all hours, especially on busy streets like Division Avenue. There used to be a stop sign right in the middle. Uh, unfortunately, it used to get ran over a lot, so they eventually just took it off, gave up on it, I guess. But it, it would help people because people would stop actually so the people could cross because that's what it's for. All those white lines are uh, purposely there for that. Jeanette Hernandez works at Ara Salon and says a stop sign would help people cross the street safely and efficiently. May that man rest in peace and will hopefully uh, certain tragic accidents stop happening like that around the streets because of all the cars that pass by and all the people that are around here. As we get closer to summer, more people will be out and about, so drivers always need to be vigilant at all times and stay at the scene of an accident to render first aid, which could be life-saving. Hopefully we get that stop sign or something to slow people down around here so people could get across safely around the streets. Please, if you know anything about this deadly hit and run here on Division Avenue South in Andre Street, please contact Grand Rapids Police or Silent Observer. Live in downtown Grand Rapids, Amanda Porter, News 8.